Hey guys, Llama here again, and I think about a year ago or two years ago, I can't even remember, um, I made a tutorial on how to make these organization cloak chains, although right now they're bubble wrapped, but um, yeah, I made a tutorial on how to make them, and I didn't really make new ones, I just kind of gave a general like how to uh, do it, and I decided um, to make brand new chains. So I and I also promised I'd film it if I were to make new ones. So I did, and this is sort of a time lapse. Um, my cameras, since they don't have a whole lot of memory, they kept they, they since my cameras have don't have a whole lot of memory, they kept cutting out. So yeah, you get parts here, parts there. Um, so I don't, this is, I guess this is an extension of the tutorial. For those of you who do not know what this Organization 13 chain tutorial is, go watch the video, I'll put like a little something here or here, wherever there's more room, and I'll leave a link down in the bottom. Watch that before so then you know what this is about. Um, this mostly has, it's more focused on the clay aspect. I didn't show the whole like how to put it on the back on the chain or link the chains together since I cover that pretty well in the main videos. Also at the very end I'll be giving notes on stuff I learned by having these chains for like a year or two for, um, yeah, a year or two, um, things that I learned and what, um, what to do and what not to do kind of stuff, so stay tuned to the end. So here's the time lapse, sort of, I don't know. Just, just, just roll the clips.
rather be what is in your heart Weep little lion man, you're not as brave as you were at the start Rate yourself and wreck yourself, take all of the courage you have left Wasted on fixing all the problems that you made in your own head But it was not your fault but mine And it was your heart on the line I really fucked it up this time Deny my dick Deny my
that's it as for the time lapse kind of part. Yeah. Uh, so notes that I have for um, the these chain thingies. Uh, commonly asked question: Can I use instead of using these little clicky things here? Can I use safety pins? Um, yeah, you can use safety pins. That works too. I just chose the clips because I thought they'd look nicer, but go ahead. You're, you're still going to be kind of destroying this little area here with the cloak, so I don't think it kind of matters much. Question number two. Can I use air dry clay versus uh, polymer oven bake polymer clay? Um, <laughs> uh, yes, you can. Um, if that's the case, then kind of follow the steps here, but don't put it in the oven. Um, and you're going to have to paint it afterwards. And when you do paint it, paint on a base coat of white and then paint on the metallic silver and make sure to get those like little crevices. Number two or three, I don't know what part of my, okay. For doing the final gloss, um, do not use Mod Podge. Um, I used it and it made the, these sticky, hence a very good reason why I made brand new ones and also if you're painting on with nail polish and you have to use a clear top coat by the way if you're painting it on with nail polish well I think even with the special Sculpey glaze too that's what I used in this video um don't leave it out in the sun it's gonna get all sticky and that's one of the reasons why it got sticky as well um, and when it gets sticky, it stains your cloak and it's pretty hard to get out or it doesn't come off. I know I have some stains on here that never came off. And when during storage, you may want to put the special like bag thing over your cloak. And when doing that, also bubble wrap these because you never know what could happen in your closet, particularly when you have cats who like to go into your closet and shred the bags that these are in. So. Yeah, make sure these are protected. My cats are pretty interested in playing with these sometimes. I think they forgot about them now though. I hope they did. But yeah, <laughs> just protect these. Keep them bubble wrapped. Like you don't you don't you can even keep them bubble wrapped until before you leave to go to the convention or a photo shoot or whatever. I think I covered all the main questions and concerns that I have for this video so <laughs> please comment rate and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video see ya